whole idea was I always wanted to be a business owner and a principal and I went to the boss, he always said when you're ready to buy the business come and see me. I organised the funds and went to him and said I'm ready and he was never ready to sell. So I stepped out fairly quickly and also you kind of realise you just give so much of yourself for so little. So it was very much about being able to do my own thing and obviously as a sales manager too, you know, you're told to drive the sales team and come up with all the great ideas and the prospecting tools. You then present them to the principal and they say, oh no, we're not doing that. You know, once you give them the costings, at least being your own boss, you can come up with the ideas and just implement them. I'd been in sales and as the top seller within the franchise I worked in. You know, there's that moment when you go, my God, what am I doing? Why am I taking such a crazy risk? It's like anything in life, isn't it? You know, you have to feel the fear but do it anyway and it was very much about that. I just um, needed to take the leap. And have I ever looked back and ever doubted it? No. I guess I've questioned should have I just gone with my own name rather than with a brand. But I like the simplicity of the brand and I feel it's a very independent brand but with the support behind it. People love the brand, people choose me because of the brand. People say I love your advertising, I love the way it stands out, it's very clean, it's very crisp. So yeah, and I like it because that's very much who I am and what I'm about. I've been with the group for four years now, I've just celebrated my fourth birthday. That was exciting too, to be you know, part of something new. I come today and look at all the people around and I'm like, wow, it's grown so much.